before we get off, I, I want to kickstart this drama. I have no problem with like certain YouTubers, but Bo Blacks just got like fucking memed on for no reason. I get it if like somebody who's as accredited as Nerd City talks like this. Honestly, I, I don't even think I would think I wouldn't even turn the other way. So take a look at this thread. Go up and down. I'm gonna give you the middle one, and I just want you to react to it because it's just really weird. Listen, chat. By the way, I wasn't the one who brought this up because in the thread I said I have no interest in continuing any no, drama with Nerd City. You I'm shouldn't continue any drama. I agree with you. Nick you shouldn't. Up, Hold on, I agree way. with you. I don't think you should continue any drama with Nerd City. I agree with that take, 100%. I have no bad oh, no, blood with Nerd City. Here? I just want you to take a look at this, Augie. Come on, put it on the screen, buddy. What yeah, is just, just, right it just his two responses. Just his two responses. Not gonna lie, the whole Boblox vs. Nerd City drama makes Nerd look like an asshole. The fact that he banned him from a Discord server and didn't give him a chance to speak is indicative that his ego is more important than personal connections. Maybe he just values his time too much to give it to people he doesn't like. Why does Nerd owe Boblox anything? Maybe some personal connections are unwanted and people should get better about handling rejection. Boblox has his own channel he can whine on all day. Just to be clear, I don't think that one's awful. It's the one that he makes after. Um, oh, how many fuck? Yeah, that one. That one. So do I even read all this? I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Just read his response. No one likes people to challenge them, especially when they put ungodly amount of effort into everything they do. We welcome friendly discourse and encourage it. We just don't owe anyone a seat at the cool table if they don't belong there. You don't get to hijack the combo. Who the is this guy to talk about the cool table? You're somebody's co-host. No, <laughs> what the fuck tweet, are you talking about? Because he's like, nope. What? Uh, no one likes people to challenge him, but we welcome friendly discord. This guy puts but face paint. But you don't get paint. to hijack the cake. What? Yeah, this guy puts on face paint and probably reads pre-written lines. Like, who the fuck are I, you to talk about the I cool table? I wouldn't even. I wouldn't even call him a co-host. He's literally just a fucking prop in Nerd City's videos. That's just so weird. Like, why would you? Again, like, Bo Blacks isn't engaging with this. Hardly. These are just small, like, fucking Twitter talk. No offense, Systemic. I know you're a donor. Um, <laughs> but like, I'm just, just saying, like, to me we're, now. <laughs> we're all kind of doing the thing where we just, you know, you're good, whatever, do your thing. If you were mad four years ago, we don't necessarily agree with everything you said, but everyone's kind of being the bigger person here. Right. But like, why are, what is this like? You don't know you were seated at the cool table. What, are you CeeLo? Are you, are you Nerd City? Are you, are you at the cool table? What the fuck's going on, dude? There's That's more to it, though. Augie, I sent you my last tweet on the thread, and then you can scroll up. He insulted someone based on the history with each other. I know a few people more in, uh, interested in divergent views than nerd. Just don't be a dick and expect him to forget it. There's an entire community that engages with divergent views. It's not hard to find. He's so interested that he blocks them. Got it. Nice talk. I'm having a civil conversation with you here and now. And you choose to resort to flippant sarcasm. I'm immortal. <laughs> I have time. What? He skips to the block when he is disrespectful. Jesus Christ! He sounds like technicals. Seems simple to understand. <laughs> Holy like it's like fuck. a it's a regular technicals <laughs> argument, dude. Dude. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What what I don't understand, and like no disrespect to Bo Blacks, but at the time shit. like this drama popped off, like Bo Blacks was kind of a nobody. Why are these people so obsessed of, with wasting time with people who have such like a small following and stuff? Like, why does it fucking matter? Yeah, but He's talking about like nerd wasting time on these people. Like, why? Why even bother then? Yeah, I'm immortal, guys. You're the guy that will quote tweet it with somebody with two followers that's like saying you're gay or something. <laughs> this guy's existence is the dawn of time and he only has 20,000 Twitter followers. <laughs> He's immortal. It, it just seems weird because they're like a huge ass channel. Like, why are they bothering? I mean, I, it's a nerd's not, and I'm gonna give him a credit. He shut the fuck up, which was a good thing to do in this situation. And I think that everyone probably could let this die and it wouldn't really change yeah, anything. Yeah, th this, by the way, this isn't like, I guess Nerd City dislikes me, but this isn't legit drama. I just see it more as like a meme at this point, like him like with the cave shit and stuff. I'm not actually like mad at Nerd City. And again, so. I, dude, we, we fought two years ago. I don't remember that as a extremely positive win for us i'm gonna be honest with you uh that was definitely not our our brightest moment in a lot of in a lot of cases and um yeah you know, I'm, i'll be the first one to say it i don't really care about this anymore i think I his new video is fantastic i wish he didn't have that conversation about you that he did because it upsets me that he treated you that way this is so uncalled for though this is literally drama mongering what what, what specifically bothers me is the next devil tweet that augie hasn't read there's out another one. Oh, no there's more, there's more. <laughs> oh, next, no. this one this one in particular bothers me 
text me for a specific no. reason. But oh read it out. God. Read it out. Bull Blacks has his own channel and his own Discord where he can rebut his ass off all day long for drama. No one is canceling the kid. I just don't think he belongs at the adult table. And no <laughs> doesn't owe him a seat. Now, these, these motherfuckers this, are so goddamn smug. Th th this one in particular bothers me because, like, it gives me flashbacks to when people don't treat me like an adult because I'm autistic and they find out I'm autistic too early. Like, th yeah. this one, I, I don't, that's probably not his intention, but when he calls me a kid and I don't belong at the adult table, I got a little mad. What I, do you have, like, 300k now? Yeah, I didn't react. You know, I mean, like, why don't you belong at the adult table no 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 are you too fucking if, stupid if to handle adult, it like if, if yeah, the, you're saying yeah. that it's not about autism why isn't it about autism i'm giving him benefit of the doubt i guess maybe it is about that yeah, i don't fuck know him. i hope it's not yeah fuck that him is. he's the devil who cares yeah he's immortal i mean <laughs> he's, he's only like, <laughs> well, he can't blow his man. brains out he's immortal <laughs> this, this shithead's only relevant because he appears in nerd city videos and as far as i'm concerned nerd's a coward for the way he acted on that discord server fuck them both yeah, i'm trying to be pretty polite with my next response but like continue reading the thread though this isn't the only thread. There's other ones. Oh God. God. The main one. <laughs> what the fuck? He's, yeah, Estemic and him are going back and forth real hard. This is like if Charm Skull <laughs> started lighting up people right now out of nowhere. Yeah. Like, I love you, Matt Pitt, but I wouldn't start fucking throwing some, some haymakers. <laughs> Sometimes in life, someone just won't like you. Maybe it's them. Maybe it's you. How we handle rejection shows maturity. Bullblack says, I agree. And how Nerd City handles me rejecting his research at face value is to block and rant about how I'm a shitty guy three years later. Holding a three-year grudge over something so minimal seems a lot more immature than how I responded to him, but ultimately is subjective. Framing it as a grudge over something minimal is a coping mechanism. He just doesn't like you, bro. I'm the one coping. Okay, Do you lol. see that as a... Again, like, I'm not trying to fuck... Oh God, we're getting so much trouble here for this fucking guy. He's going to be so mad at us. Uh, my point is like, I don't know. How do you not see it as a grudge if you break into song and dance at the thought of like, hey, this guy could come into the call. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like the, it was, hey, I like Boblex. I don't. Here's four minutes of why. Like, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, th there's quite a bit of response. If I break into song and dance about why I hate Slacker TV, it's because I have a grudge against him. I don't like him, you know? So is this guy's whole account just simping for nerds? Yeah, I didn't know that. Go, That's go, literally go, his whole, no, his go, whole back, go back to the thread and look at my response. To him. He didn't respond to it, but read it out. I'm the one coping? Okay, lol. Keep using Twitter search to look up your friend's name to argue with Rand by Cans about how mature he is for having a five minute rant at, a fi at 5 a.m. About some critical tweets he got about his YouTube video three years ago. Dude, Boblax. I mean, it's true. I don't know. Like, it's him. just a, it's just annoying. Didn't you build your Did, channel that way? No, I read tweets of people who actually have followers and get likes. No offense, <laughs> Demon. RFC After Hours is a live trending issues and entertainment broadcast with co-host Bo Blacks, broadcasted every weekday, Monday through Friday, starting at 6.30 p.m. Central. The show is for entertainment purposes only. All chat messages and donations read are the words of the original messenger, and certain viewpoints expressed do not reflect that of myself or Bo Blacks.